we were talking about finding a friendships as an adult yeah. is hard. I love it, but it is hard. Male friendships, Ooh. I'm told, can be difficult to come by. And according to the American Survey Center, more and more men are struggling to connect with each other. Hmm. Do you Very notice this with the men in your life? I'm trying to think about it. I notice it with the men in my life. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Like their friends, are they the had friends since they, they were Exactly. Yeah. They have had this core group for many years and that's it. Yeah. But on a positive note, some of the most successful television series have introduced us to male friendships to look up to. And they are so strong that not even a series cancellation can break them. <laughs> Early on, we had Chandler and Joey from Friends. You know them, you love them. Uh, then the Wesleyan University's very own Ted and Marshall. <laughs> ah, How I Met Your Mother. Ah. Shout out to the Cardinals. And who could forget the logical yet illogical friendship between Leonard and Sheldon from The Big Bang Theory. <laughs> I like that. This morning, some of the most iconic male television friendships are being turned into cocktails, because why not? And mixologist Gareth Howells is here to shake things up. Gareth. Hello and welcome to New York Living. Good morning. Thank you very much for having me. Oh, it is a pleasure. It is a pleasure. Do you have a strong male friendship that you that you want to shout out? I'm very lucky. I do have some incredibly strong male friendships. Excellent. Here we go. And a lot of them helped us come up with these cocktails here, just Amazing. bring a little bit of inspiration. Well, that was that was my my first question to you. Is this whole concept your brainchild? It was not my brainchild, but it was something I was asked to get involved with. Love so it. we did our best, but these cocktails are really representative of the male friendships that we've seen appear in some certain t television hmm. series that have been around recently. I'm I love it. I'm so glad you did. You have three drinks for us, inspired by who? What do we have here? So the first drink here, this is the Diamond Dogs. <gasps> <gasps> my favorite fellas, this Ted is Lasso. Ted Lasso. Mm -hmm. Tell us about it. It is. Now, this is a play on an old fashioned. So within Ooh, this- Ooh, yes. Now, look, I don't want you to be scared. This is whiskey, and it is yes. around about 10 o'clock in the morning, but you it's going to be perfectly fine. Nothing we're not even seeing. <laughs> it's 5 o'clock somewhere. So we're using a base here of Aberfeldy 12 Highland Single Malt Scotch. We're using a honey syrup. Quite Ooh. simply, if you wanted to make a honey syrup at home, it's really easy. Just mix two parts mm. honey to one part water and oh, integrate. Oh, my goodness. I'd recommend if you're going to do it, use a really good 100% raw local honey. We're using honey here from Tremblay Apiaries in upstate New York. Oh, nice. And Only this particular one is their goldenrod honey, which is fantastic. A couple of dashes of bitters. If you're at home, you just want to stir that mixture over ice, pour into yes, a rocks nice glass. If you've got a large format, use it. If not, regular ice is fine. And then just garnish with an orange zest. So Ooh. is the honey representative of, of Ted Lasso's like empathy and love? for his fellow diamond dogs? 100%, okay. it is now. <laughs> I was gonna say, that's a real deep body song. That is well, because I, I, I love those characters and they're iconic and I think of an accurate and wonderful And we all need some diamond dogs to run things like And also, the, the vessel the is also. Marisol is very, I very interested vessel. in the vessels for I love her libations. Vessel. What's up next? This is the, the take on the Tom Collins, obviously. This is. This is the Tom and Greg Collins. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Greg. So, of course, It moving. smells of dysfunction and wealth. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was going for sophistication. Okay, but yeah, that we can too. go with that as That's, well. Okay, fine. <laughs> So this is a play on a very traditional classic cocktail, the Tom Collins, which would usually be gin, lemon, sugar, and then soda. What we've done here is we're using the same bells uh, based the incredible Aberfeldy 12 Highland Single Malt Scotch. Ooh. We're then using a honey jasmine syrup oh. here. So a little bit different. If you're making mm. this at home, just mix mm. one part to one part jasmine tea with honey. Mm. Again, use the best honey you can find because it's going to make the best oh. cocktail. Mm -hmm. A couple this. of dashes of bitters, mm. and then just top with soda water, and then you have this beautiful, elegant, sophisticated long drink. I love a burnt fruit. The burnt bitters, citrus. the bitters is Tom. Tasty. The, oh, the fizzy not the is the scans. awkwardness of cousin Greg right now, there. Just for everyone at home, I know that we use dehydrated lemon wheels here, but you can use a lemon wedge or just a regular lemon syrup. You know what? Or should Splurge. You wish. Yeah. You're doing it Do in the dehydrated fruit, okay? To succession. Yeah. You gotta be, be like the one percent. Um, <laughs> What is I, I, I love a coupe glass. First of all, let me let me start by saying that this is this is the only whiskey in the building. <gasps> this is the only whiskey in the building. Of course, love it. We're only talking murders. the only murder. Yes. Now, when you look at that classic partnership of characters, and then you add the influence of Selena Gomez, this is really a representation mm. of what's happening in this cocktail. Um, this is traditionally would be known as a Bobby Burns. A Bobby Burns. A Bobby Burns. Bobby Burns. So it's yeah. equal parts. Again, we're using Aberfeldy 12 single malt whiskey with sweet vermouth. I'm using Martini Chin -chin. Rossi in okay. this case. And then just a dash of Benedictine. I also like to put a dash of bitters in just to take the sweetness out. Oh, well, well, well. Oh. That is a strong fella right there. That'll put hair on my dress. Yeah, on my, on my chest. Dress. I like it. And my dress. If you have a hair on your dress, we have oh, lint rollers for that. 
the finish is quite nice. It is. It dries nice. out somewhat. Yes, it does. Yes. It does. It's like it's a little like bit you sweet. It's like you know what you're doing. It's like you know what you're doing. Now, okay, we, make we've one. been told that there's a surprise cocktail here. We, I see rosebuds. We did. Well, basically, there's an iconic partnership that we hadn't yet celebrated. And Marisol, Alex, <gasps> that's the two of you. So we were sent some information through from your team regarding your I'm sour grapes and ice water. <laughs> <laughs> I heard you were short and sharp, but that was only what they sent through. <laughs> short and sharp? I wonder who gave that description. So we wanted to do something colorful and energetic, so we created a quick cocktail for you, which I'm going to make now. Is so we're simply going to use equal parts, Aberfeldy 12. Is, and that's the whiskey. That is the whiskey. I like it already. Wow. What's the name What's of the, the cocktail? What's the of this libation? <laughs> <laughs> the name of this libation is, and I hope I'm saying this correctly, the Yippic. It is the Yippic. That is our nickname for one another. I believe there's some relevance <laughs> to the Would name you Yippic. If you want to know the etymology of the Yippic, go to our Instagram page, NY Living. Uh, there, was a, there was a video. I did see it. <laughs> oh, my Love God, you, Brent. Yes. Love you. This is my favorite segment of all time. Okay, so what, what, we, we what we're doing now is we're using, again, equal parts Lonely Pratt, which is a French vermouth. Ooh. But what we've done is we We've infused it with pea flour, which gives it this <laughs> incredible purple hue. I love it. That's wow. my favorite Now, color. what we're going to do, and I should have taken the load of this first. This is my fault. Is we're going to add some Saint Germain. Oh, I love oh, Saint Germain. Saint Germain. Which is I an love the accent. flour and yes. excusing the drips liqueur. Do you know what? It makes you human. I love it. Yeah. A couple of dashes of bitters. Oh. Okay. Mm, yes, that's necessary. He's so good at this. I know. And this is With art. my hand shaking, sweating bullets, we're about to get through this. We are almost done. I love the. I love, it's per I love on, that it's purple yibbing. Where is that purple yibbing? I'm hanging on to your every move here. Now look, remember. Ooh, that's a long stir. That's what she said. You're not really a bartender if you don't have the biggest spoon made. Okay. So now what we're going to do is just put you stir this over ice. Look at how pretty that is. That's gorgeous. <gasps> and then. We are going to distribute this between the two glasses. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh snap. Everybody, okay. the Yipic. The Yipic, but wait, there's We've more. Made it. There's something else, I suspect. There is something else. And now what we're going to do is top it with martini and rosy prosecco. Come on. We need some bubbles. We need some bubbles. Are you free tomorrow? <laughs> and, the <laughs> and the day after. Whatever you need. Oh. Yeah. I like this. I like this. And then because I heard you were fancy as well, what we decided we to do is just quickly garnish fancy this. We're a little fancy. With some rose petals too. <gasps> Now, ladies, this here we go. This is the nicest thing anyone's ever oh my God. done Garrett, for me at 10, The Yipic, ladies and, and gentlemen, the Yipic. Sir, it is a pleasure and an honor. Thank oh you. Oh, my gosh. It's... Thank you very much for having me. This has we been a blast. We made it. We made it. Let's see. All right, hold on. Mm -hmm. To the Yipic. Oh, it's fantastic. That's divine. I love it. You know what? If you're free tomorrow, we are having a one-year anniversary That's why show, I asked and we need him. a bartender. We need so a bartender. Our you can, we'll you Yipic's on deck. Thank you so much.